look, Willie's just running scared. He's, he's using his position, he's the Minister of Broadcasting, and he's saying all these things, and I'm saying, Willie, you don't understand history, you don't understand the law, you're making statements which are ridiculous. He was trying to liken one person, one vote with the House of Commons or the upper house in the, U in, in the, uh, the uh, United States. Now, the reality is he didn't get it. That it's not a matter of uh, how many votes people got. And under MMP, we've got two votes, as he said. And that's why he said it's not one man vote. It's about, the same, about every vote having the same value. That's so simple. And here comes the point. I was, and I didn't see Willie, or any of those other people, none of them, back then on the campaign for electoral change to MMP that promised to bring far more different, diverse people to Parliament and the has, I was at the forefront of that campaign. In fact, somebody wrote a book and accused me of being the, uh, the reason why we, that we, we got there on that. <laughs> he made a vicious attack on me and said, Winston Peters was responsible, and I'm proud of that because we went from being just four Maori in Parliament uh, in the Maori seats uh, to over, since 1960, uh, 1967, all the way to, 2000, uh, to 1978, only four Maori had ever got on the general seats. I was one of them, in a general seat. And I knew that under MMP, they'd get a far better go, we'd have a far more diverse parliament. And I'm hoping that have, with that diversity, we don't abuse the objectives that the people out there on the streets working two and three jobs and weekends out and all that sort of thing. We don't abuse the privilege of remembering what they want. And it's housing, health, education, first world wages. And then Maori will look after themselves and we deal with the things they want. And that's where Parliament is massively failing.